First, in a story you'll only see on 41 Action News, the city is facing a potential loss of millions of dollars. It was heartbreaking. It was a tough day. Thousands of fans and millions of dollars all impacted by coronavirus concerns. I mean, it's a global concern, right? It's not just a Kansas City concern. It's definitely not a basketball concern. This is a global concern, so that's why the impact feels so heavy. The Kansas City Sports Commission tells us the NCAA and the Big 12 have to consider a range of factors. It's not just the basketball players. It's the cheerleaders. It's the band members. It's the parents of these kids. But you have to think first and foremost about every single person that steps into that venue, whether they are an athlete, if they're working in the concession stand, if they're a fan, what could happen, and that's what we're working to eliminate. Recognizing that a global pandemic like this impacting March Madness is unprecedented. This one might just be the craziest thing I've ever seen in my adult life um, dealing with sports. And the effects may just be beginning. Oh my gosh, this is going to impact for the next decade. Again, FanFest is canceled at the KC Live block in Power and Light, but it'll still be open for normal business, and they will be showing the games.